Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel, and today we're playing 1-2 cash games. Buying for this game is $200. Alright, over here with 3-bet-8s get called pretty good flop with flop the boat. I'm going to be betting this board pretty often. Don't hate the idea of checking, though. Uh, two of clubs on the turn. Can go either way. We're going to go ahead and bet again here. Get raised. So, a lot of times with the boat, you wouldn't want to... Like just jam it in here, but I don't think we're gonna see a fold ever. And say min click it like this with only one of five behind, so we're just gonna get it in here. I want a river card comes that scares them. So we get called queen seven, and we hold a massive cooler there. So I got cut off open with three bet queens. Let's see the four bet. Um, let's see here. Obviously, you can jam fine. Let me go ahead and fly here. And interesting flop. At 45, and I think the overpair and open under, we're just going to jam now. Get it in on the flop. Go for the jam. See a call has tens of flop to set. Oh, man. Three sit cooler there. All right, so we three bet ace queen here, get called. Pretty good start. Just going to flop top, top. That call 10 of clubs turn. I'll go for a check jam here. Not 100% sure. So if they interesting river here. Uh, top two, I think I'm going to go for a block to call if they jam. Those will do some, turning some hands into bluff. Say they have like pocket nine, seven, eight, particularly. Um, not that they're going to have like one club hands, but. All right, please don't have clubs. Pocket nines turns into a bluff, so yeah, that's exactly what we're hoping for, particularly if they have a club. It's actually a really good bluff candidate from them. Blocking straights, blocking backdoor clubs. So anyways, call down top two. And when we're snap calling, it's not because we like love it, love it. <laughs> like we might beat one value hand, um, but not going to be folding there. There's a tick in the line. So we got limp button raise here off a shorter stack. And flop top set. Um, I think I'm gonna just go for check here. All right, set the trap. That's just gonna play as a call. Turn king check. Check check and uh, trying to think if we want to bluff catch or go for jam. I'm gonna try to induce a bluff here. Only one ace left in the deck here. So make them think I maybe have queens, jacks, or tens or something like that. And they bluff queen high. Ace is good. Cold four bet here. This is under gun open. Button three bet. We cold four. Pretty quick call. Quarter pop here. Flop eight seven seven. See the call king on the turn, but it's a club. Uh, four bet pot. I think I still like trying to go for this here. And eight river. Ooh, that's not a good river. Um, is this way too thin to jam? I mean, what do we get to call? Because it's a cold four bet pot. I'm gonna jam. This is maybe way too thin. Snap call is not good. Uh, ace high flush. That was maybe way too thin. You guys can let me know what you think on that one. Here we open five, small one flats. We're going to flop set. Ace, 10, five, bet the flop. Turn the ace, nice. So we got the boat here. Um, I mean, can kind of go either way. I think I mainly am just going to try and target the ace here. Go ahead and bet. Don't expect it stacked up. They're going to fold an ace by the river here. Hearts do come in. I still expect them to call any ace here, but we shall see. Or king, queen comes in too. Snaps it off. King four of hearts. So they river the nut flush. Fives gets paid. Button opens. Three bet king ten suited. So we threw that pre get called flop trips. Very good start. See a call. Five turn. Bet the turn.
River 5. Well, that's a sad river. We're chopping other 10x. Uh, let's see. Are we trying to get him to bluff? Or are we trying to go for value? I think we're going to go for value versus some pairs here and try and get him to call with clubs missing. So my best bluffs would be like the 7, 8, no clubs here probably. So it has 8s and we end up being good. Very nice for us. Cold 4 bet here. So this is cutoff open, small line 3 bet. We cold 4. Damn call. Ace king aces. Oh boy. Well, we flopped the straight. We still got to fade some stuff though. Wow. All right. Holy we'll crack aces. Oh, that was so sad to see the all in, but then it's so good to see how it worked out. All right. So we got cutoff open throughout the ace 10 suited. And all right. I'm going to flop the ace high flush draw. Queen five, four, two clubs. Bet call. Turn the flush. Nice. Uh, I'm going to go small the turn here. Calls, three river. Could be hard to get called by worse here. It's not clubs on this one, but maybe they have like seven, six or something. Set this size. I don't want to fold. So we're all in here. They call pocket sevens. Yes, they did have the sevens. Very good for us there. Open here, get three bet. We'll call the fives on the button. King six, three, small bet call. Turn 10 here. Uh, checks to us. They were going to start turning these fives into a bluff. And then if we get called bluff jam non spade rivers. All right, here we go. I have five four suit in range here, too. Snaps it off. King Jack. All right, so turn the fives into a bluff. No good. I want to review that one, but I think you got to turn some of those small pairs into bluffs. And we just have aces everywhere. <laughs> Sorry, putting in a cold four bet. Calls. Um, nine five two. I go for the check here. Get a little trappy. Aces with these. More likely to check here with the spade. Not as worried about spade runouts. Protects my check range in these spots sometimes. Uh, ace is the best one because we're not as worried about runouts. Like I said, having the spade. So we're just gonna check call here. And I mean, if we're being really picky, I probably wouldn't want the spades to come in, but at least we have the ace of spades. So it's a very clear call if he jams. Could be value jamming worse still, too. The over pairs here. All right, call it off. As Jack's just got a hold. Nice. Ace is good. So open queens get three bets. Putting in the four bet here. See a call. King I flop here, start small. See a call four on the turn. Oh, I gotta go ahead and check the turn here. So against small, we'll call one more. River gets interesting. But so we call here, river 10, check the river. And I think if he jams here, I'm gonna make a fold. Feels a little tight, but. Depends how often I think he bluffs diamonds here. He's gonna be a little cautious because I can have tens in this line. And I can still have definitely have like queen, king queen. I do think the four is relevant. Like I feel worse about calling this than say like the two of clubs on the turn because I like I said kind of ace four suited. Um, so I might even call it two and then fold the four. I don't know if I'm maybe giving the four too much credit here, but we'll let this go. We block king queen suited, which makes me feel not suit like we the combo we have is pretty good. Not having a diamond to call, but we decided to give up on river. So we got limp, cutoff raise from Turbo Raptor. We're going to put in the 3 bet from the button of Ace King. Let's see a call. 9 3 3, go for bet here. Bet call, Queen of Clubs turn. I'm going to be betting turn here as well. Um, SPR is pretty low. I think we can go small and turn. This might not be correct. Pot's kind of gotten a little inflated because of the preflop sizings. So we'll go small turn. And then I'm going to be jamming river a lot here. So we block ace queen. Don't block king queen back to our flush draw, which would be nice. 
Actually, maybe this is the one combo we don't bluff. Sure. Um, nah, I'm actually still gonna go for it here. Maybe shouldn't because we don't block King Queen suited at all, like backdoor flush draw. But we decided to go for it. It's really hard to have like strong hands here in this spot. I right, do get the fold. Right, especially teams like getting that fifth year option on players, like right at the tail end of the first round. Alright, so open, we three bet aces. Big blind cold calls off a shorter stack. And gonna go ahead and bet flop here. Jam would be good. Alright, raise. I know it's a small raise, but I can't see them raise folding. Um, actually, we have the ace of spades, and there's not gonna be a rivers that kill them. I'm actually just gonna call. I'll take it back, what I was gonna say. If this is like a jack high board, I don't want like more actually killing turns, but we're just gonna call here. They happen to have a bluff, keep it in. We have the spade. They check here, we're just going to check as well. All right, all in pre around the, here. King Jack of Spades, got to fade some stuff here. Just say all in on the turn, but anyway, aces hold up. All right, YouTube, that's the end of another cash game video, and we do book a nice win here today. So, played for six hours, 2,986 hands plus 980. Also, got some rake back from a deposit bonus, which I probably be something around 50 to $70. So, adding to our yearly profit, which is always good. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed today's video and the hands. If you did, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you ever want to catch the live streams on Twitch, I have a link to my Twitch channel in the description below.